Okay, I want to uh, make a quick point on uh, polynomial functions and their derivatives. Um, there's kind of like a, like a cool relationship that happens uh, between them. By the way, this only is for polynomial functions. This, does, this doesn't include like uh, radical functions with a square root or rational functions. It's only for polynomial functions. Um, if you don't know what a polynomial or the definition of a polynomial function is, you may want to go back and review that. But basically, um, the relationship is this. The degree of the derivative of a polynomial function is one less than the function. The degree of the derivative of a polynomial function is one less than the function. That's always the relationship. So if you recall, when we had our, um, our example of x squared, when we found the derivative, of x squared using the difference uh, quotient, we ended up with 2x. So notice how this function has a degree of 2 and the degree of the derivative is 1. So the derivative of a polynomial function always 1, uh, the degree is always 1 less than the function. So for example, let's write out a couple of examples here. So if, um, if the function is a quadratic, then its derivative is going to be linear. All right, if a function is cubic, the derivative, a degree less, is going to be quadratic. And um, et cetera, et cetera, right? So if we have a quartic, function, the derivative will be cubic, right? Degree of four, degree of three. So the derivative is always one less for a polynomial function than the actual function. Uh, another one is here, um, linear. The, uh, the derivative of a linear function, uh, unless it's a vertical line, any other line will always be a constant. And that constant will always equal the slope of the line. <clears throat> All right, so that relationship always holds. Uh, so you may want to try that. Like, uh, if you want to prove this yourself for a little challenge, try um, take the uh, function, let's say, 3x. Uh, use the definition of a derivative or the difference quotient and uh, you'll get that the, uh, the derivative of this linear function is a constant and it's always equal to the slope of the line. If you really want to generalize it as a challenge, take this function, so mx plus b, right, just a general line, use the uh, difference quotient and prove that the derivative is always equal to m. That could be your little challenge for, uh, for this section. But uh, the main takeaway um, is just a specific case only for polynomial functions. The derivative is always a, a degree less than the actual function.